This is a significant development in the long-running issue relating to historical allegations of mistreatment of First Nations players at the Hawthorne Football Club. Earlier this week, the AFL ended its protracted investigation into those allegations after reaching a deal with some of the First Nations players and their families. The same group of players and their families have now penned an open letter. It's been signed by former Premiership star Cyril Rioli and his wife Shannon, former player Carl Peterson, Jermaine and Montana Miller-Lewis and ex-staffer Leon Egan. It reads, we are some of the Indigenous families who endured racism at the Hawthorne Football Club. We were separated from our families. We were told an unborn child would ruin our futures. We were treated as special projects and control of our lives was taken from us. We told our truths in confidence because we believed that it would bring change. That confidence was betrayed. We never asked for money. We were never scared of being named. We will now bring them to a Human Rights Commission conciliation to listen to the truths that they don't want to hear. We reached an agreement with the AFL not out of fear but strength because the AFL finally apologised to all First Nations players for racism in football. So that, lodge, that complaint now has been formally lodged with the Australian Human Rights Commission. The next step is possible mediation if that falls through uh, there's still the avenue of pursuing civil litigation.